project I'm going to be showing you today is aimed at uh, classes or clubs or camps and showing really how the sprout can be used to teach uh, the basics of rocketry. One of the really handy features of the Sprout is the stop motion application. Uh, this is perfect for teachers and makers that want to show step-by-step -step projects because using the, the projector and the cameras built into the Sprout, you can take step-by-step -step frame grabs of your project and you can capture each one to show all of the steps involved in building a project. Everything's built right into the Sprout. So one of the nice features of the HP Sprout is the overhead projection camera. And here I've just projected out a, a template um, for the rocket, uh, the rocket building template here. And I can simply project it down. I've taped down just a piece of blank paper. And now I'm going to trace the design for the rocket onto a blank sheet of paper, and then I'll have all the pieces I need to cut out. Now we've got all the pieces we need for the rocket body. So we've got our rocket pieces, and we've got our masking tape and a half inch piece of PVC pipe for our building form. So we're gonna, first off, we're gonna put three pieces of tape around the rocket body piece at the top, middle, and the bottom. I'm gonna make sure that that slides off of the piece of PVC because we're just using the pipe for building. We're gonna work our way down the rocket, overlapping pieces of tape, keeping it nice and smooth. Okay, there's our launch tube. And then we have this new little stand here that we 3D printed, that I 3D printed earlier in the week. So we're gonna use this to put the fins on, and this will help you get the fins nice and straight. So I'm gonna use this to hold my piece of PVC pipe and the body tube. This is called the pressure cap. It's really important because all the pressure from the launch is going to go up against this launch tube. We're going to take two pieces of tape and we're going to crisscross them over the launch tube like that. Pressure cap, then we're going to put a piece of paper around it like that. Then we've got a real good seal right there. Now we're gonna tape the nose cone onto the top of the rocket. So we're gonna actually take the rocket out of the launch tube now and put it into the fin guide like this. This will get the fins on spaced evenly and facing parallel to the rocket body as well. So we're just gonna tape one side. Now we're ready to launch. 